Hi friends, let's understand one more property of Laplace transform which is called as first shifting property or first shifting theorem. Now what is first shifting property? Now to understand it, let's start with the definition of Laplace transform. Now we all know that Laplace transform of f of t is given by integration 0 to infinity e raised to minus st f of t dt and which is called as phi of s because this integration is going to give us a function of s hence we call it as phi of s now what is first shifting property so by using first shifting property we can evaluate value of e raised to minus at f of t so you can find out laplace transform of e raised to minus at f of t by using first shifting theorem so let's see what is the answer so let's see the value of property so to find out the value of this property we will apply the definition over here so by definition this will become 0 to infinity e raised to minus st as it is now be careful my friends here in the definition when we have f of t we write down the same f of t in the integration now this time we have e raised to minus at f of t so we have to write this all function in the integration so this will become e raised to minus at f of t dt so this will give us 0 to infinity e raised to now here this power will be added so minus sign is outside s plus a in the bracket t outside f of t dt now to get value of this we will again compare it with the property or i will say so to get value of this we will again compare this with the definition of laplace transform so in definition this s denotes the constant and hence we get answer as phi of s so similarly this integration is similar to this integration only the difference is instead of s we have s plus a so when we will evaluate this we are gonna get phi of s plus a and hence the value of laplace of e raised to minus a t f of t is nothing but phi of s plus a and this is called as first shifting property now similarly we can have this power a as positive that is plus a t so in that case we get phi of s minus a so these two properties we are gonna use to solve few problems of laplace transform now what is first problem so let's consider one example let's say that laplace transform of f of t is equal to s upon s square plus s plus 4 and we want answer of laplace of e raised to minus 3t f of t so just observe my friends here we have e raised to minus 3t with this f of t so this e raised to minus a t term will denote that you have to apply first shifting property so here i will apply first shifting property so by first shifting property we will get laplace of e raised to minus a t f of t as phi of s plus a now here our question is what is laplace transform of e raised to minus 3 t f of t so we will get phi of s plus 3 because a is 3 now to find out phi of s plus 3 we will take help of phi of s now where is phi of s now phi of s is already given in your question so laplace of f of t is given as s upon s square plus s plus 4 this is nothing but our phi of s so i will find this phi of s plus 3 from this phi of s by replacing s with s plus 3 everywhere so we will get in the numerator s plus 3 in the denominator s plus 3 the whole square plus s plus 3 plus 4 so everywhere i have replaced s with s plus 3 now 
this numerator will remain as it is denominator will become a square plus 6s plus 9 plus s plus 3 plus 4 now numerator as it is in the denominator a square will be as it is 6s plus s will become 7s 9 plus 3 12 and 12 plus 4 16 so it is equal to 16 and this is the answer of e raised to minus 3t f of t by using first shifting property.